Hi there! In this video tutorial, I will show you how to use a graphical user interface like Git GUI to manage your online repository at GitHub. So, you see here my local and online repository. So, first thing first, we need to install Git GUI. In Ubuntu, we type Git GUI. Click to show the technical items. And then install Git GUI. I have already installed Git GUI. I assume that you have already established local repository. Now Git GUI needs a terminal window and we should open one. In the terminal we go to the folder that we have established our repository and then type Git GUI and hit enter. So we see Git GUI. Here are the files that we have to add and send them online. Here are the changes that have been done to files. And this is the area that shows the files that are already staged and are ready to send to the repository. The comment area that we write our comment about these files that we have changed. Once we're ready, we can select all the files and then add them to the staging area. We press commit and stage the commit. All files are ready and changes are ready to be committed. So we write our comment and then press commit. Now before we send the files, we can tag the changes so that it can be easily downloaded from other users. To do this, we click on Repository and Visualize. Then right-click the master with the change creating tag and add a tag name, let's say 4.5.6 version, and then we can add a tag message, which is optional. So we have added the tag and we're ready to send our changes to the remote server. We click push and we don't forget to include the tags. And then press the push button. GitHub will ask for the username and the password. So we have successfully sent our changes with the tag. Refreshing the page. And as we can see, two minutes ago we have already committed. If we click the tags tab, we can see our tag that can be immediately downloaded as a source code file. Tags are very convenient way to download files. Thank you for watching. See you next time.